Eluzai. Funny, <laughs> it's a funny name. Um, so I started rapping in like ninth, tenth grade. Prior to that, I was um, I was like creating music, uh, still trying to learn it. I think we can kind of date that back to oh nine to ten. Um, and in like the tenth grade, I hadn't really been like christian I, I had been christian by like name and, you know because you know family and all that uh and i went to a very strict baptist school for four years mm. uh so all of my high school and in 10th grade they decided to put us in a class about the revelation like revelation mm. um now wow. if you if you are on the fence about where your faith is that is kind of like a like a, a very much so a uh, blunt way to to figure out what side you're on. Um, and after like being in that class for like a week or two, I was like, I'm go, I'm dedicated to Christ. I don't want to see this. <laughs> so word, word, I, word. I remember the exact I, I the day was is like I'm in the class. I'm like, no, nah, I'm gonna remember. This is the day I was saved, where I was dedicated to Christ. I ripped off a piece of cardboard off of my, my notebook and i wrote the date down like this was the day i this was the day i'm we're changing it all yeah, yeah. and then uh i started shortly after that i was encouraged by people at a, at a church i was attending like, you know just like give it all for god and there was a whole bunch of events that coincided um uh, you know with my my boy shad uh introducing me to like uh lecrae and beautiful eulogy and and, and all that um, my love for like hip hop just really like blowing up more and more around this time. And uh, at that mm. moment, I was like, I really want, I really feel like I want to like my, I, I want to do like a form of like music that elevates God or is like a ministry or, or something mm. like that. And so that's how mm. I, I, I became uh, like a, like a, like a rapper, Christian rapper, rapper with, with Christian themes, however you want to kind of, uh, you know. Uh, I, I don't. I'm. I'm not. I don't hate any of those titles. Any of those is fine. <laughs> um, uh, but um, I, at that time, I didn't. I was. I was part of a uh, a fan group for Childish Gambino at the time. So I. I didn't feel like I could use my name. My name's Ludwig. And if you know anything about uh. Gambino, his in-house producer, who is also pretty big, is also a white gentleman with long hair and a beard and his name is Ludwig. So wow. <laughs> I uh I um I remember getting roasted in the Facebook like chats. It's just like you think you can oh. share your beat like commissions in here because your name's also Ludwig. I'm like, dude, I'm like 16. <laughs> <laughs> but um so I decided to go online and in my my Bible thumper phase reading nothing mm. like KJV and stuff like that. I was like, I gotta, I gotta uh, yo, I read KJV for so long. We, 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 can, we can talk. We can talk about. We can talk about that. The KJV. Why KJV. did KJV? Because, because like the because like the Bible thumper to like reading KJV pipeline is so real and like people, <laughs> people don't even like understand. Like it was this dude years ago. Like when I first got saved, and it, his name was like Demaris. And mm -hmm. you could just tell, like, Puh had absolutely, like, no love in his heart, bro. And all day, every day, he'd just be on Twitter going stupid about how, like, only the KJV version of the only Bible the is, like... Oh, my uh, gosh. Yeah, yeah like... Was, he, only that one works. Only the, this yeah. is, like, one that's translated directly from it, even though yeah. am, am, the, the Amplified version did the same thing, like, 100 bro. years ago in the 1900s. Not saying that. <laughs> So, um, like, he, he would literally be on that. And, like, I remember it was so funny because that was, like, in 2016. And then mm -hmm. in 2018, uh, I, I jumped on, I jumped back on Twitter, and he was still on the same, like, thing. <laughs> I remember messaging him, and I was like, bro, do you understand? It's been two years. Like, are you, like, a robot? Like, what's wrong with you, bro? It's, it's the diss track that will never stop. Man, um, but uh but, but, kinda, ahead, yeah. but with the yeah so <laughs> bible thumper days kjv so i wanted to find like a a a, a very religious sounding name or something uh, to give you an idea like i i don't know why but i wasn't like keeping up with a lot of the current 
music like christian music strangely enough i was th- this is gonna date me a little bit um but i was listening to like cross movement and stuff like that back in the day word and, word and that goes this is this is going far back i was listening to like lecrae's that's, early discography and, right, and stuff like that be real yeah. and rebel um, rebel yeah and this wasn't like and this i wasn't listening to this in like in like 08 or like 05 i was listening to this in like 2011 2012 I was listening yeah. to I was listening to Lamp Mode, Shy Lin, Stephen the Levite. So mm-hmm. this is yeah. um yeah, this is very much so the Calvinistic Bible Thumper era. Oh, and um it's so funny. So I decided to find a really cool name and I thought it has to have a Z in it and it has to sound cool. So yeah. I went on I, I found the Hebrew name Eluzai. Eluzai, however you want to say it. It's Eluzai to me. Um, which is a uh, hebrew for god is my strength and i f- thought that that was really cool um and, it's yeah. actually, and and looking back at it now for all the times i kind of pondered the the concept of changing my name it's actually a really good uh reminder of like where i came from and what god is to me and i, I think mm-hmm. it kind of orchestrated itself to kind of be that that thing that kind of like almost like a mantra where it's like hey you know kind of just remind you and inspire you it's like god is your strength let that be it you know 